hello what is the value of x given that you have root x plus x equals 2 then let's have it to be solution so from here we have root x plus x equals 2 so from here we have root x by taking this one to the other side, we have 2 minus x. So now to eliminate this root, let's take the square of both sides to the power of 2. So from here, this, we cancel out this, we have x equals 2 minus x and parentheses to the power of 2. Then when we have a to the power of 2 equals a times a. So from here we have x equals 2 minus x times 2 minus x. Then when we have a minus b times a minus b equals as a times pick this a times the whole of this a minus b minus b again times a minus b so from here we have x to be 2 into this 2 minus x then minus x times 2 minus x so from here we have x 2 times 2 will be 4, 2 times minus 2x, plus times minus will be minus. Minus times plus here will be minus, 2 times x will be 2x, minus times minus will be plus, x times x will be x to the power of 2. x equals 4 minus 2x minus 2x will be minus all x plus x square so from here we have to collect this line like term to the other side and this implies we have let's write this first as 4 minus 4x plus x square then minus x we have to set everything to be equal zero then we write this will be x square minus 4x minus x will be minus 5x then plus 4 equals 0 so from here we have to obtain the value of x by using quadratic formula x equals minus b positive or negative root of b square minus 4ac over 2a where we are going to have the parameter a the coefficient of x square 1 parameter b minus 5 parameter c 4 so from here we have x minus times this will be minus into minus 5 positive or negative root of minus 5 in parentheses to the power of 2 4 times a is 1 times c is 4 then over 2 times 1 so from here we have x minus times plus will be minus times minus will be plus positive or negative this will be 25 minus 16 over 2 and this will be 5 positive or negative root of when we have 25 minus 16 here will be this then this will be 9 then this one will be 0 thus we have root 9 
over 2. So from here, we have x equals 5 positive or negative. This will be 3 to the power of 2 over 2. Because we have 9 to be 3 times 3, which equals 3 to the power of 2. This will be 5 <coughs> positive or negative. This will come out this. We have 3 over 2. So from here we have x 5 plus 3 over 2 or we have 5 minus 3 over 2. So we have this 5 plus 3 8 over 2 5 minus 3 2 over 2 we have x 8 over 2, 4, 2 divided by 2, 1. So we have x, 4, 1 to be the solution. Then let us now verify whether x equals this will satisfy the problem given to us. So to check recall we have x four comma one so from here we have root four then plus four is it going to give us two root four two plus four this cannot be equal to two 4 plus 2 will be 6. This does not equal to 2. So from here, S equals 4 is not correct. So let's also check when S equals 1. Because we have root S plus X equals 2. Root 1 plus 1 is going to give us 2. Root 1 is 1, plus 1, it's going to be equals 2. 1 plus 1 is 2, equals 2. So the left hand side equals to the right hand side. So this implies x equals 1 is correct. So finally, we can declare that for root s, plus x equals to x equals 1. So if you are new here and find this video interesting, don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more master tutorial videos.